11 26 2011 happy thanksgiving weekend to everyone what we have here is the smf platform yes it's our own platform and we own it and we built it over many 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 years and it's a market maker platform not a day trading platform so mmt's a delta what i have is five dollars and seven pennies correct me if i'm wrong as far as each one of these uh uh, half delta line movements are going to mean in our system okay the thing that we're going to talk about is where we hit that high reversal with a weekly buy signal and we've come down with the contagion in the market we've sold off and gapped down with the futures and there has been liquidations um, that hit the market and big funds that not big funds but firms that had the collateral liquidation against one positive asset against another bad one and they have to sell the winners out here is the diamond right here that we're interested in and this was on 1014 and basically at that time uh, Google in our platform was above the Delta line 563 at half Delta at that time we have come down and tested these lows here where the original earnings gap had occurred and we can see clearly in that info panel which will be redesigned into digital display but you were minus a half delta that day delta line at 563 at minus half delta on the daily or yes the daily in the price movement so we have filled this diamond in where the earnings gap came in here they pulled it back they consolidated it on this uh, daily chart that we use this is a platform it's not your regular charting platform but it's where the dollar price movement between the buyers and the sellers are going to happen and what these diamonds mean is that we did put in that high that we called for we never did break above the 618.47 on a closing basis and that's where the selling started once we hit this high peak right here this was on the week of 1116 and it was a half bar at 604.54 okay closing half it was actually minus 13.58 um, but you had and that was that you had an IR 95 at the time where it was strong at the top but it started to weaken right below these uh, daily diamonds here this is where we started to break this upper end of that teeny line and we went down diamond lower diamond lower and a gap lower and all of this was contributed to worldwide economic events in Italy and Spain as well now and Merkel and Sarkozy and everyone else and US debt crisis also packed that in there and their failures and you have filled the gap with the liquidation we are pulled back within a very robust trend at very key levels that once the liquidation is out of the way we will come over here and start applying this to a 565 put that's inflated it's a December expiration weekly next weekly okay you can see right here's a 560 call that got marked down from $18 down here to 1126 so we're going to be applying our 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 inflated put option here and you can see the two differences you you can see that clearly the 565 put got marked up from the bottom here so it got marked up from the very bottom it was marked up to 1090 on 1125 okay and the low print here was 690 so there was a nice trade but notice that the premium given is less premium that look at the they give you less premium on the put side but look at the amount of call side they take away the high was 18 and the low that call 560 call okay which is slightly in the money and the 565 put is slightly in the money as well not much just about both of them are just about right at the strike price but both strike prices are within the call 560 and here it's 565 put five dollars okay anyway we're going to conclude 
the fact that in the next series of live videos for Monday live entry orders everything is done live here so the next segment for MMTs is where we're going to price our entries here and where we are going to price the markdown entries here starting the calendar month which will be the end of the month of November and that will be Monday morning today is Thanksgiving weekend 11 26 of 2011 and we wish everyone all investors and traders around the world truly uh, a Thanksgiving day with each other and what that happy Thanksgiving is about and one thing that we do here is that we do give on a daily level but we are always live in the market and we're always pointing out how they mark down the prices and the calls and the puts against the public against the highest professionals even they extremely have the same amount of problems if you're a mom and pop watching the video they have the same amount of emotion same amount of a problem same amount of everything when it comes to understanding the actual movement in the chart uh, how to trade a weekly contract these are weeklies okay and they expire next week so here's the expiration week Google closes at 563 and if I go in here and I put the 560 call over here which I'll do here is the bid and the ask right here 12-02-2011 is when they expire and they're a weekly okay and here is the 565 put right here and the five uh, here is the call contract right here and you can see that the bid right here is 930 on the bid 1260 on the ask that was going into the closing bell and we're going to steal the call because if the equity does get price and we're going to go through several of them if the daily equity holds this diamond or we come down and we hold where the post earnings were they blew out the last quarter they're going to report in January of 2012 that they are once again I'm going through what we're going to be trading there's that 560 call now on the flip side I'll show you the level 2 here in the actual put side the 565 that expires 12 2 I'll also put uh, which is this contract here so you can see it 565 put that's what it is that was the close they marked it down to 690 on 1125 it's a weekly weeklies are priced totally different than monthlies and the mathematical formulas that are used in market maker operations that's who we are that's how we're able to get these low entries selling at the high they mark it down to 690 hey that's a nice run down at the wholesale entry on the put side that's what it did and it's only a weekly and we're only doing the weekly contracts okay we have in the next video segment we're gonna do exactly off video we're gonna give the entry prices here and we're going to give the entries and exits here on both contracts so they're going to mark the calls down or they're going to, they're going to mark this side of the market down and here is the call here is the markdown 560 call in the video and you can see right here that it's friend right next to it right here in the video in this candle that's the lower price there at seven dollars they walked it up there that was that other level two we showed you and here it is 565 put 560 call how to trade them in the next segment and how to match up a what is the difference between a weekly and a monthly contract we will be doing the December contracts as well